hopefully you are here as you have questions like what are some examples of fossil fuels? How are fossil fuels formed? And what are fossil fuels used for? If so, grab yourself a pen and some paper. Welcome back to Design Technology On Demand. My name is Charlotte and I make weekly videos helping you to succeed in your design technology GCSE. I just want to say a massive thank you to anybody that has already hit that subscribe button. If you haven't already, make sure you do. It's completely free and it does help support my channel's growth. So let's recap. In previous videos, we have already started to look at the impact of fossil fuels, how designers, companies and engineers are starting to make drastic shifts on how to help support global warming. In this video, we're not going to look so much about the impact of fossil fuels, but more how are fossil fuels formed. For that, let's quickly remind ourselves, what are fossil fuels? Fossil fuels is a general term for a natural fuel or a non-renewable energy source. Some examples of these non-renewable energy sources are coal, oil and natural gas. So what makes these energy sources non-renewable? Unfortunately, our global infrastructure heavily relies on fossil fuels to power, heat and move around a day-to-day -day basis. If we take a moment really to understand this problem with a world population estimated to have reached 8 billion people, can you even begin to imagine the amount of fossil fuels that we would need to keep the world running for a day, week, year and for future centuries and decades? Let me help you understand this. In just a year, the average American consumes more than 23 barrels of petroleum products. And think, there is approximately 335 million people in America. That's 23 barrels of petroleum. Times that by 335 million people is a whole lot of petroleum needed. So the point I'm trying to make here is if everybody is using them, eventually we are going to run out. And with these resources, which are unable to replenish at the rate that we are using them. Okay, so we now know some examples of what fossil fuels are, coal, oil and natural gas. We also have a basic understanding into why they are known as non-renewable energy. Let's build on this. Why are these energy sources unable to replenish at the rate we need? These fuels come from decomposing plants and animals that existed millions of years ago. They are found buried within the Earth's crust and hold carbon and hydrogen, which is what can be burned for energy. Okay, so we understand that it takes millions of years for these type of fuels to form. It all depends on what combinations of organic matter were present how long it was buried and what temperature and pressure conditions existed at that time as it passed. So let's focus into how these fuels are actually formed. Coal is usually found within sedimentary rock deposits. This is where rock, dead plants and animal matter are stacked up in layers. Oil is primarily found as a solid material situated between these layers of sedimentary rock. Natural gas is typically found in the pockets above the oil deposits. So we have learned some examples of what fossil fuels are, how they are formed, and let's finalize the video with how these fossil fuels are used. Starting with coal. Coal is mainly used to generate electricity, as well as being a key ingredient in the production of steel. Oil or petroleum products are used to fuel automotive as well as textiles, plastic, and so many more. Leaving us with natural gas. Natural gas is used for heating and generating electricity. What are the key takeaways of this video? Examples of fossil fuels are coal, oil and natural gas. Fossil fuels are formed over millions of years, making them a non-renewable source. They are made up of decomposing animals and plant matter that lived many years ago. Coal is found within sedimentary rock deposits. Oil is found between the layers of the sedimentary rock. And natural gas is found in pockets just above the oil. Let's end the video with a question. Make sure you put your answer in the comment box below. Where are fossil fuels found? If you found value within this video, then please do hit that like and subscribe button to help my channel's growth. You may also want to check out some of my other videos linked in the description box. See you in the next video.